All right, so I was just doing a normal HDMI port on this PlayStation 4 here, and I was taking it apart, and then boom, look at that. It's completely broken. I plugged it up, and I tried to power it on, and nothing. This is completely dead with an HDMI port, broken. I don't know what else could be wrong with this. All right, this whole shell here is cracked, and uh, this doesn't seem too serious. It's just a flex cable for the power button. Let's connect it and try it again. Let's see if it powers on. Oh, it does. Oh, nice. Perfect. Oh, and it dies right away. <sighs> Oh boy, this sucks. I don't think it's the uh, power supply here. Well, let's check out the power supply anyways. Let's take it apart. This shell is really weird here. I think there's a uh, misprint here from the uh, actual manufacturer. There's a misprint for the place where you put the thermal pads. So there's a lot of thoughts running through my mind right now on how to repair this one. So I got the motherboard sandwich out here and this is the power supply. And as I shake it here, there is something inside. Something is broken. It could be this power supply. Let's take this apart. Hopefully we have donor parts and uh, we'll fix it. Well, these two pieces fell out here and I kept looking, looking, looking and I think I found that this little transformer over here um, is broken. I did test it electronically and it's electronically sound. So my only concern are these things uh, conductive. And no, they're not. I think this power supply is okay. I don't know how I'm going to do this with one hand, but check this out. I'm going to turn it on and we're going to do the... Um, the thermal cam right now. Watch. Boom. You see that with the thermal cam? There's a memory chip. There's a memory chip that blows up. That one right here. This one blows up. I've never seen that before. Um, I don't know. Is this memory chip close to the misprint here? Very possible. Let's check. So yes, I'll be damned. That's the memory chip uh, place for the uh, thermal pad. And that's the misprint right here. Strange. Could it be related when it dropped the misprint, messed up the memory chip? Very highly likely. Let's remove this memory chip and uh, try a new one. Another discovery. That area gets hot too. This is the memory power area and I believe this sends power to the memory that's uh, blown. So let's remove that memory chip and replace it and hopefully we get something. Right here at my station, I removed the uh, memory chip right here. And I have another donor here that I'm about to get ready. Got my DDR6 stencil in the mail. Let's do it. All right, we're ready to heat it up. All right, here it is looking fresh. All right, we did a second pass on it. It's looking fresh. Perfect, let's clean it up a little bit. See, the donor chip is a Samsung, and these are not. However, um, memory chips are interchangeable, so let's put this one on. All right, we just finished installing it. Let's uh, wait for it to cool and go test. All right, I have it connected here enough just to test. Oh, oh. Something else must be broken here. We no longer have the memory problem. Don't drop. 